Scoop, Scoop. Galaxy, now for the sports. Right. Today, not much going on, partly cloudy, high of 42 and low 33, with that peak around 2 p.m. Now to the five. Good morning, Monomoy. Today is Tuesday, February 8th, and it is a day six in our schedule. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the weather. Today is going to be cloudy with some AM showers with a high of 45 and a low of 27. Now to the five day. Tomorrow, Wednesday, it's going to be sunny with a high of 39 and a low of 35. Thursday is going to be partly cloudy with a high of 45 and a low of 31. On Friday, it's going to be mostly sunny with a high of 38 and a low of 34. As we head into the weekend, it's going to be a partly cloudy with a high of 46 and a low of 30. And lastly, on Sunday, it's going to be a cloudy with a high of 33 and a low of 25. That's all for weather. Now to Jake with some announcements. Thank you, Susanna. Now for some announcements. Student Council will be collecting donations for the Harwich Family Pantry as part of their Stu Co Cares fundraising efforts. Look for us during Jossum. The class of 2026 is selling pop popcorn to raise class funds. Please see an eighth grader or Miss Gurney know to place an order. Monomoy Interact Club is looking for donations of plastic grocery bags. We are hoping to collect as many as possible by February 18th. They will be used to make mats for the homeless around Cape Cod. There will be collection bins around the school to collect them. Contact Michaela Crossan, Caroline Upson, or Ms. Casey for any questions. The school store is having a fabulous February sale. Sweatshirts only $15, t-shirts $2, winter hats are going fast at $5 and more. Need a gift? Show you care. Give Monomo gear. February is Black History Month. Today we will highlight Harriet Tubman. Harriet Tubman was an enslaved woman who escaped and became the conductor of an underground railroad in 1850 to 1860. She led other slaves to freedom while there being a bounty on herself. I was a coordinator of the Underground Railroad for eight years, and I can say that most conductors can't say. I have never ran my train off the track, and I have never lost a passenger. Now to your new sports host, Courtney. Thanks, Jake. Hi, I'm Courtney, and I'll be taking over sports for this term since Caroline quit after one show. On Friday, girls basketball beat Martha's Vineyard 52-28. to Lucy Mon with 10 points, Melissa Velasquez with 16 points, Helen DiGiovanni with 11 points, and Caroline DiGiovanni with 6 points and 4 blocks. Also on Friday, boys basketball lost to Martha's Vineyard 77-74 on senior night. Dan Gould led the Sharks with 23 points, and Michael Rocco followed with 17. The Monarchs had a great win against Cardinal Spellman on Saturday 4-1. Two goals by Chris Matten and another two goals by White Archibald. Also on Saturday, the Furies beat Nantucket 5-1. Great game by the girls. On Sunday, the Monarchs kept their winning streak going by beating SJP 5-2. White Archibald with a hat trick and Lucas Tambolio with three assists. For today, boys basketball plays at home against Cape Cod Tech at 6.30. Pop out and show your support. Girls basketball plays away at Cape Cod Tech at 5.30. I will get you those scores later this week. That's all for sports today. Now back to Jake with some more announcements. Thank you, Courtney. Are you interested in what is going on in the world? Would you like the chance to learn and talk about it more in school? consider joining the Monomoy Regional High School Global Studies program. You'll have the chance to meet regularly, attend a global service trip, do a senior res research capstone, and earn a second diploma at graduation. If you're interested, see Mr. Dixon and attend the Global Studies meeting, Day 2, Jossam A, in Room 141. Applications are available for Mr. Dixon and are due on Monday, February 14th. Applications can also be found on the school website. And now, Mr. Smeltzer with the Ad Lucum Root Word of the Week. Have a wonderful day, Monomoy. Buenos dias. Today's ad lucum root word of the week is sub slash hypo. Both roots refer to something under, below, or less than. On the Latin side for sub, we have the following derivatives, subatomic, suburb, and subterranean. On the Greek side for hypo, we have hypothetical, hypoallergenic, and hypothermia. Adios, amigos. <laughs>